Hey guys, welcome to Mary's Backyard Garden. Today I'm going to gather some herbs for winter use. Winter is coming soon. It's now September and winter is around the corner. So I better start um, getting the stuff, every st all the stuff that I want from the garden before it's too late. So I'm going to start by getting some herbs Every year, before it snows, I usually gather some herbs and I store them in the in my freezer because once the once the frost fall, once we get the first frost, the garden is over. They die. So. This is our time. And this herb is uh, perennial, so they come back every year. But when snowing, the leaves fall, uh, uh, die of course. <laughs> so you cannot uh, pick them in the winter. They'll be all dead. I use this a lot in my cooking. I usually just plant the stuff that I normally use in my cooking. Look, they look beautiful, right? Now let's take some celery, no not celery, um, parsley. So these are the new shoots because like I said the um, groundhog ate a lot of them, all of them. So I better pick them now because by the way the groundhog came back the other day and ate more tomatoes. It's annoying. And if I don't pick this up, I'm sure he's going to eat them too. They are young shoots, but it's good, see? Okay. Here. Oh, I have some in here too. I mean, he was all over the garden. Oh my goodness. Now let me take some sage. there. These are very expensive when you buy them from the store. Herbs are real expensive. So if you can plant them, why not, right? 
Oh, I forgot to uh, show you something, guys. So, I have another kind of, so that one is the um, regular sage. And I planted this new, new kind of sage. It's called um, an apple sage. Um, I was reading about it, and it says that um, it's either perennial or annual. annual. So, I think it will survive the uh, winter. So, I'm just, just going to leave it in... in uh, see if it's going to blossom next year because usually um, they have beautiful uh, blossoms so I'm so excited it's growing really good now we're going to pick some um, onions green onions okay so I want to take the whole thing right here we gotta dig it up first Now, if you don't take this, uh, they will they'll come back every year too. I have a lot, so see, I have a bunch here. So I just want to keep some in my freezer. Look at the bulb. Nice and big, right? Oh, beautiful. Nice. There, look at this. Let me cut the roots. Okay guys, so I have a few more of the uh, parsley here. The groundhog actually missed this one. <laughs> See over there is all um, bare, but it's the new shoots are coming out too. Then we'll shoot. It's a nightmare having groundhog in your garden. Honestly, they eat up everything. Okay, so here we go. And now I'm going to get some marjoram. The stem of the marjoram are kind of hard, so you have to use the scissors. There you go, this are my drum. Let me keep picking, because I want more. Okay guys, so I picked what I need. Uh, look at this lemongrass. So for these ones, I'll pick them up too. Uh, but I will wait maybe till the end of um, September. That way they can their bulb can get bigger. Um, last year I planted some too, but uh, and I did an experiment because I thought these are perennial. I thought lemongrass are perennials, but they are not because I left them in the garden for the winter and they did not come back. They were all dead. So this year I have to pick them up and put them in my freezer. So now let's go pick some basil. Okay guys, now let's get some basil. These are beautiful. Wow. This 
see how they are flowering if they flower if you don't wanna if you're not picking them up yet and uh, you see the flower coming out you got to trim that otherwise it won't be good they bolt gather them okay wow look at this fresh herbs fresh herbs guys oh yes there's one more important herb in my cooking it's the um, rosemary okay so this one also is not perennial so normally I would just plant them and then when summertime is over, I pick them and put them in the freezer. So look at them. Look at this. These are very expensive too if you buy get them from the store. Look at that. Mmm, smells so good. Wow. I planted, um, I planted like five of these, but only two survive. I have one more over there under the apple tree. Look at that. Nice. Okay, guys. So now I have rosemary added to my basket. So there is rosemary, thyme, a lot of basil, green onions, marjoram, parsley, and sage. So I'm going to wash them really good and put them in the freezer bag and store them in the freezer for winter use. Okay guys, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, Please give it, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.